Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl DK1 Original coming at you from a very different location. But anyway, um, this is a very impromptu video but I really wanted to upload because I missed my Monday upload and I missed my Wednesday upload. So I wanted to make sure that I give you guys something today. So one of the main things that I really wanted to discuss was um, the last time I spoke about um, dating and relationships and you guys really responded well to it so i thought today i'll come and talk a little bit more about that again but this time i really wanted to speak about being dribbled like you know like being dribbled but more specifically being dribbled by church at first i was like i wanted to call this church and if boys but i was like settle down settle down d settle down but anyway just like being dribbled in church like guys uh, and this does not only go to guys like i'm not even speaking about guys only like even ladies do this like it's like Vazalani, like keep honey like why are we like this like like church is the one place that you would think like you know if you get you a church boy like you good and i'm gonna say church boy because obviously i'm a girl like duh but also you like get yourself a church girl you know the same thing could happen but like you get yourself a church boy you get yourself a church person and you think you're good like oh yes forever and always in the name of jesus oh in the same name of jesus that they got you with have you ever been dribbled <laughs> at church man and then you out here like, i worship and you just better because the person they dribbled you with is in the worship team and now you just out here looking and you're just like Mara, my life when's a galan like how and you can't even complain because you can complain to because in Barcelona also we've got this thing where we like we don't date as date we are doing special friendships we're doing courtships whatever the heck name it has now but being dribbled in church like what's going on can we have a discussion about it like and you know i say this because i work uh, like i work with a lot of like young people in church and whatever and like guys like honestly like some of the stories that you hear and some of the things that people have gone through in church like mm -mm, jesus jesus send help because your children are doing their most they are doing too much they're doing more than they need to because oh bird it's bird up here and there's nothing worse like there's honestly nothing worse than somebody who like okay maybe you don't know if you don't go to church but basically like church guys will come at you in the name of marriage like they'll be like i like you i want to marry you Kabang, i'm afraid a whole mary ne? and then play you like I, I don't know is it maybe because I personally feel like some of the most faithful people are actually people that are outside of church and I don't know whether it's because because I feel like if you're being played by somebody who lets you know that I'm gonna play you down here for games it's better but being played by somebody who promised you forever it's just like right like it's better like honest i honest this is just how i feel i feel like it's better if there's games but you know ahead of time that there's games you know what i'm saying like you're like listen i like you but i ain't trying to get into nothing serious i'm just here for a good old time how about we have a good time together right instead of saying i like you you're my only one you're my one and only mara church boys and driven should we dissect the f boys in church should we get into it what do you think well let me know in the comment section down below this is like a quick run something that i've just seen happening a lot and i'm just like it shouldn't be happening in the church that's just personal opinion that's just how i feel but anyway let me know if you have ever been played by a church boy or a church girl matter of fact and let me know what you think about it like what's your what's your take on it do you agree with me do you think it's a bit too much do you think i'm being melodramatic what do you think right make sure that you leave your comment in the comment section down below make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up make sure that you are subscribed if you got to this part of the video and you are not subscribed check your life sis check your life 
make sure that you subscribe make sure that you share this with a friend and let me know what you're thinking about dribbling or maybe just in general maybe you don't have to just put it in the church like why dribble like why get into a committed relationship if you're not going to be serious once again remember to like this video comment in the section down below and share it with a friend and more than that make sure that you are subscribed guys have you noticed that i haven't been posting weight loss Wednesday? i'm sure you can because the double chin is thriving <laughs> oh.